Another romantic meal with just the three of us. Need to push an hour. 7 p.m. okay? Dickwad. If he stands me up again, I'm just showing up at his apartment with a notary in one hand and a baseball bat in the other. Tell me again why getting the house is so important. I don't even know anymore. <laughs> Debbie's family is throwing her a party for fuck's sake. Gender party. You gonna go? It's baby related, so no. You'll always be the person who raised them. You know, regardless of what they do or where they live. What if I don't want to be that anymore? What if I just want to be their sister? Well, so now you hipsters want to come in, now that we don't want you. Ironic, isn't it? Don't rile them up. Kev, snuck in through the back. Got a whiskey sour. Hey, defend the fortress, head up to the roof, and dump acid on their heads. All right, hang on, Tommy. Where's your ghetto cred, buddy? What is this? Food stamps? These are stamp stamps from a post office. You even know what food stamps look like? I tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna let you stay because I like your initiative. But you're gonna have to pay cover. How much? 10. 15? 20? 20. Yeah, 20 bucks. Now go tell your friends. I'll let in four hipsters every hour, but it's $20 a head. You got it? Go tell them. We're in. We did it. All right, but easy, 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 easy. You all get your turn. We're gonna need to get a bouncer. And we need to get a scary one, like pants shittingly scary. Want some coffee? Sure. This is all for your sculpture stuff? Yeah. Used to get scraps from burned down homes on our runs, but homeowners don't love it when fine men take their stuff. Cream or sugar? Black. You sell these? To friends sometimes if they're drunk enough. What's this one? That's my latest. Love to find the treasure inside the trash. I try to find a secret life in things. What it wants to be instead of what it is. Is that what you're doing with me? Good question. Can I kiss you? I thought kissing comes after you've had sex a bunch of times. <laughs> yeah, kissing comes whenever you want it to. Even now. Fiona's not coming. We can just start without her. So, thank you guys all so much for coming. Bathroom? Oh, it, right down the hallway. Um, so, as you guys know, I, I kind of wanted to keep the gender of my baby a surprise, but Erica here, who's been like a mother to me, suggested I throw this party and include everyone. So, that's what I did. Uh, this is my doctor. I'm, I have to take this, so sorry. I'll just, I'll be one sec. This, and guess what? I, I think I'm gonna name the baby after Erica. Erica, if it's a boy. What do you think of that? Thumbs up. Awesome. <laughs> um, I'm in remission. Hey, wow! Fantastic! That's so awesome. We got involved, and unfortunately, my marriage was in a transitional place at the time. 
I understand that while not banned outright in our code of conduct, sleeping with students reflects poor judgment on my part. It not only jeopardizes my standing with the university, but compromises the emotional well-being of the student in question. I'm willing to take a probationary leave of absence, during which time I will prepare a statement regarding my behavior that the university may choose to make public at any point. In the meantime, I have terminated all contact with said student and intend to continue this course of action. We also recommend that you seek counseling. We understand this is not your first encounter with a student in this capacity. It is simply your most public. I've already begun to see a therapist who specializes in sex addiction. Thank you, Dr. Runyon. We'll render a decision shortly. It's not a crime to want to fuck. I mean, well, what is it with you people? Uh, he hasn't been getting much sleep. Uh, I've been working him pretty hard. We would like to provide you with mental health services to help you cope with this ordeal, Mr. Gallagher. <laughs> what happened between Aline and me wasn't wrong. Okay, and, and I don't need to cope with it. We're, we're in love. Okay? As I've said, this relationship has been terminated. Sex addiction? What the hell is that shit? Look, I know you had to say that stuff in there to cover your own ass, but it's not an ordeal, okay? Not for me. Could you stop for a second and fucking look at me? So what, that's it then, huh? But that's how you want to end this? Don't follow me. Don't text me. Stay away from my home, my husband, my son. Don't make this any uglier than you already have. Do you have a sanitary pad I could borrow? A machine in the bathroom might have one from the 80s. Hi. Thanks for coming. This is gonna be really quick. This is Abe, the notary. Where's my ring? It's in a safety deposit box at the bank, which is closed right now, but I can grab it for you first thing tomorrow morning. Okay, um, these documents release your rights to the house so that I can buy it back under my name. So my signature gets you something you want? Correct. Where's the paper that gets me what I want? What do you want? Well, I wanted a wife who wasn't a lying, cheating sack of shit. But I guess that's impossible. So I'll settle for an explanation. I want to know why you think I owe you anything.
You don't. So this is a, a favor? I guess. I do favors for friends. We're not friends. So basically, this is you asking me for something and offering me nothing in return. Stay here tonight. Uh, uh, sure. You can sleep in Will's bed. Son, what you doing under there? Everyone's gone. You all forgot you? Yeah. How long have you been under there? Two days. It's it cold at night. I pee my pants to stay warm. Wise choice. Hey, how about how about sharing some of those beans with a hungry old man? I called my mom in prison. She said someone would get me. And here I am. Your messiah. <laughs> Hand me the hot sauce, would you? It's over. Gus wouldn't sign. I can't get the loan and I lost the house. It's not back yet, and I'm too excited to sleep. Sure. Don't worry, I promise not to touch you, even though you're way too adorable. <laughs> yeah. I'll stay down on the floor like a good little bitch. Mm. Oh, ah, I can't believe I got a second shot. Oh, I'm gonna try to have a life this time. I'm gonna make pie cleaners and go to shows and hit the gym. I'm gonna fuck women, <laughs> if Tyler will let me. Even